startup helicopter manufacturer Copter is close to finalizing the design of its all-composite, large-cabin, single-engine SH-09 and is already preparing for production at its headquarters in Mala, Switzerland, as well as a newly announced facility in the United States. If you are not able in this industry to produce close to the customer, you better do not produce at all. We will pre-assemble all subsystems uh, in Switzerland, but we will produce, assemble, customize and deliver product support from Lafayette in Louisiana. Copter is taking possession of a building originally constructed by Bell to assemble its 505 light single. Bell later decided to assemble that helicopter at its facility in Mirabel, Canada. We will build up, so this work will be starting this year already. Uh, 2020 will then be the real year of build up, uh, recruiting personnel, training the personnel, getting the process landscape right, uh, etc. So that uh, in, indeed, uh, beginning of 2021, we can full-fledged operate this facility. By the end of February, the third prototype, dubbed P3, has completed more than 50 hours of flight testing. P3 has already achieved a speed of 126 knots and an altitude of more than 5,000 feet. But there's still more of the flight envelope to be explored, Andreas said. These development flights will be finished uh, soon, I think uh, in early summer. And uh, PS4 and PS5 will join a PS means pre-series aircraft, so this uh, is the final configuration for certification. P3 will be dedicated more for the validation of the dynamic components, and uh, PS4 and PS5 will do uh, specific uh, parts of the certification. PS5 in particular will be the dedicated aircraft for extreme temperatures, uh, because we wish in the initial certificate to reach already quite an important scope of temperature from plus 45 uh, to minus 45. The company intends to achieve EASA certification in the second quarter of 2020, with FAA certification following shortly thereafter. It expects to deliver the first aircraft by summer that year. We have today an order book which is standing a little above uh, 60 aircraft to be delivered in the first three years. And the first aircraft will go to our launch customers, uh, which will be in Europe with American customers being served quite quickly after. Meanwhile, the company is developing a virtual reality simulator in partnership with Switzerland-based VR Motion for SH-09 training. So far, the market has responded with confidence to the multi-role SH-09, which offers the versatility of a twin-engine helicopter without the complexity. If you've enjoyed this video, please give it a thumbs up, share it, and subscribe to our channel. Also, visit AINonline.com and check out our e-newsletters for all the latest on the aviation industry.